iron supplements do work. If they are taken correctly, they will work. One of the mistakes is that people take too many. So the maximum frequency is one every day or even one every other day. Take it with a full glass of orange juice, fruit juice, something with high vitamin C. Early in the morning, when the hormone hepcidin levels are lowest, which enhances iron absorption, an hour before any food or any other drink and any medications. Dairy products and caffeinated beverages interfere with iron absorption. Tannins in tea will completely bind the iron in the gut and nothing will be absorbed. If there is still side effects, then reducing the strength of iron in the preparation will be helpful. Sometimes it doesn't matter how well you follow all of the steps and all of the tips and all of the tricks, sometimes your body just isn't gonna absorb oral iron effectively. So then we might say, you know what? It's time to consider intravenous iron, iron infusions. This is a treatment that can bypass all of those issues of absorption in your gut and puts that iron right into your bloodstream. And I think it's very important to talk to the midwife or the doctor about the iron preparation and to work out what is right for you. We're not aiming for perfection. Your baby's gonna be perfect, but we're aiming for progress. You're important. Your children's health is fully dependent on the decisions you make. So pay as much attention to your blood health as you do to your bank account.